Hey everyone, so we've got ourselves a new shot for shot video here, 18 holes with tracers, with drone shots, at one of my all time favorite golf courses, Tobiano. So in this round, I was playing the Iron Tees, over 7,100 yards, goal of course was to break 80. Now, we've already done a, a video at Tobiano, we did a 2v2 match play, so if you haven't seen that one, it's linked below, definitely go check that one out as well. And of course, we got to keep the channel going, so please remember to subscribe, shoot me a comment below, let me know what you want to see up next, what courses you want me to play, and let's go from there. So, without further ado, let's hit the play button on the classical music, and remember, you better be keeping the ball straight. So that was a really good start, you know, hitting that drive on the first hole that uh, was one of my better drives of the year even. Nice little tap in for par, great start for hole one. Parring that first par five is a great way to, to kick off the round. So back to back pars through holes one and two definitely was not complaining about that. I actually hit a perfect tee shot on this third hole, but took a little too much club and went just over the, the back of the green there. Oh, good read by Magnus and the great weight. Pull four, once again, another drive right down the middle. And uh, the side slope caught me on this oh, no. second shot and I just kind of pulled it left and long. Nice little chip, one hop. Just needs a little Man, bit more. Got to get the hand in pocket here on the fifth hole. Uh, it's a 475 yard par four, and I had a 125 shot in with a 52 wedge here. So that just gives you a bit of a scope as to how well I was driving it this day. Nice shot, Ben. Uh, I actually hit this 52 wedge, went a little bit greedy down the left hand side to try and tuck it in the corner because this green slopes hard left to right. And I wanted to kind of spin right down, back down to the pin. I landed it just in the rough and it actually kicked left into the bunker. So it was a very unfortunate uh, outcome. Okay. 
So this this round here, Tobiano, is actually some of the best tee shots I've hit all year with my driver. Um, it was dialed in through the first six holes, and I just felt like, you know, driver was coming out, huge confidence booster. I just couldn't seem to get my approach shots going. Pitching wedge on the second shot, thought it was perfect, and once again, end up short. As you can see here, short game got the better of me big time. Almost snapped my putter, so lots of emotions here, but had to rein it in and keep my cool and hopefully, you know, turn it on for these next few holes. One of my best shots of the day out of the bunker here. I thought I'd hold it, but still, I'll, I'll take a sandy par on that seventh hole any day of the week. Hole eight, beautiful, definitely a signature hole here. Uh, one main tip is just to keep it left side fairway. It does slope fairly hard. You know, tee shots, second shot if you're laying up, uh, even if you're going at the green, you wanna keep everything on the high side because the entire hole just slopes hard to the lake. Oh, just a dart. I missed with the driver today at least. Now on this ninth hole, definitely a layup hole. I should have pulled the gapper out. I was getting greedy with the driver and uh, it definitely kicked me in the butt on this one. No. Second try out of the fescue, launched it up there. Thought it was gonna be tight, ended up going just a little bit long. There we go, that's better. Fortunate three putt, so a plus seven front nine, not my greatest at all. So I knew I needed to shoot even par on the back nine in order to break 80. Definitely something that's doable, especially since there's three par fives there. So I just needed to dial the game in, get some birdies and make it happen. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Yes! And that right there was definitely a TSN turning point. Some great confidence after having terrible approach shots for most of the day, and even that one didn't find the green. Uh, it was nice to be able to, to make a birdie there. Had a great second shot here with a 52 wedge again, landed just right at the pin and then once again that slope. Brutal pin placement. Oh, it doesn't oh, matter for Magna. Oh! I wanted back to back so bad.
Another terrible drive here, so driver's losing a bit of confidence on the back nine, but uh, thankfully found my ball and just had to punch it up to the fairway. I knew I needed to go up and down from about 60 yards out in order to uh, save my par here. Fourteenth hole, another signature hole, just a beautiful backdrop with the lake and mountains there. Now, unfortunately, a definite layup hole. I pulled the driver out once again, getting greedy, and just flared this one a little bit too far to the right. Should have been a gapper. If that was a gapper shot, I would have been in perfect situation. I left this approach shot short yet again. Sit. Wow. So the green must go like that. Get in the hole. Another great shot. Thought I had a chance to get in the ace, but uh, landed just beside the hole and rolled about uh, four feet past. Nice birdie. And heading into this par five, I knew it was a birdie opportunity, so things were looking optimistic about the possibility of breaking 80 still. Just had to dial it in for the last uh, three holes. Finally learned uh, my smarts, laid up with the gapper. Off the tee, just hit it nice and pure down the middle. Read the number. Oh, and once again, a birdie putt that is just millimeters away from dropping. So. Couldn't get really any uh, any long ones to drop today, unfortunately. Like nice little seven iron into the center of the green. Finally, wrapping up with the 18th. Enjoy that backdrop with the water, fescue. Just love this hole. Pitching wedge here, expecting it to land firm at the front and roll to the back where the pin was. Unfortunately, it landed very soft. Landed soft? We've got a chance to break 80 with the birdie putt here though. Come on. Oh. I definitely gave it a run and launched it about five feet past, but hey, at least I didn't leave it short. I unfortunately missed the comebacker for one of my few three putts of the day and a final score of 81. So Tobiano, I will be back to break that 80 mark. As always, please remember to subscribe, leave a comment below. Uh, I'd love to hear if you liked the classical music with the drone shots and the video as a whole. Um, so yeah, love to hear from you. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.